karaoke books. Aesop's Fables. A version for young readers. Authors, J. H. Stickney and Aesop. Audiobook. The Mice in Council. Some little mice, who lived in the walls of a house, met together one night, to talk of the wicked cat and to consider what could be done to get rid of her. The head mice were brown back, gray ear, and white whisker. There is no comfort in the house, said Brown Back. If I but step into the pantry to pick up a few crumbs, down comes the cat, and I have hardly time to run to my nest again. What can we do? asked Grey Ear. Shall we all run at her at once and bite her, and frighten her away? No, said White Whisker, she is so bold we could not frighten her. I have thought of something better than that. Let us hang a bell round her neck. Then, if she moves, the bell will ring, and we shall hear it, and have time to run away. Oh yes! Yes, cried all the mice. That is a capital idea. We will bell the cat. Hurrah! Hurrah! No more fear of the cat, and they danced in glee. When their glee had subsided a little, Brown Back asked, but who will hang the bell round her neck? No one answered. Will you? he asked of White Whisker. I don't think I can, replied White Whisker. I am lame, you know. It needs someone who can move quickly. Will you, Grey Ear? said Brown Back. Excuse me, answered Grey Ear. I have not been well since that time when I was almost caught in the trap. Who will bell the cat, then, said Brown Back. If it is to be done, someone must do it. Not a sound was heard, and one by one the little mice stole away to their holes, no better off than they were before. When there is trouble there is need of someone to act, as well as someone to advise. If you liked what you heard, please subscribe to the channel.